A working iPhone 6 prototype gets leaked in a huge batch of videos. The first leak schematics show us what to expect for the iWatch's design, and carrier information leaks when to expect the metallic Moto 360. I'm Jaime Rivera, and even though our team is returning from IFA, the first link in the description leads to our full coverage. This is Pocket Now Daily. Let's begin today with some sort of official news as Motorola is uh, the company that did not give us the information for when they're launching the metallic Moto 360. Right now you can only pick up the leather one and then you pay $80 premium if you want the metallic bands whenever they are available. But Verizon has just posted this information that just tells us that apparently the 360 and its metallic variant will be shipping to customers as of November 11th. So if you really have to only get the metallic variant, that's when it's going to happen. But if I were you, just get the leather one and then buy the strap. Now, a company that is not making any headlines over how many phones it sold is Amazon. Reports claim that the company has only sold around 26,000, 35,000 phones over the last couple of weeks, which is terrible. So it seems that they've woken up and smelled the coffee. Apparently, you can now get this phone for a penny, uh, or it would be close to a dollar plus a two-year contract on AT&T. Yes, the phone is still an exclusive. It has performed terribly, and we still can't figure out ways to like it. One of the most anticipated phones for the fall is the Galaxy Note 4, so far one of our favorites at IFA. But if you're wondering exactly how well is that uh, display when it comes to color accuracy, as Super AMOLED displays have never been the best, reports claim that uh, there are some professional tests that are being conducted, and apparently this is one of the most accurate displays in the market for 2K right now. And uh, we had tested this with the Galaxy S5 Prime in our review, but obviously these are scientific tests, and apparently this is probably one of the best displays you can get, so stay tuned as our reviews will reveal more. And as we are just one day away from the launch of the iPhone 6, supposedly the event is happening tomorrow, it seems that there are some leaked videos that show us absolutely everything we want to see of this operating iPhone. And uh, as you expected, this is pretty much a bigger iPhone in every way, meaning there is no other additional way to use the canvas on this display except for the fact that it's got more icons. But there are some separate reports that apparently there are some simulator leaks from iOS that claim that there were will be this landscape mode for the 5.5 inch iPhone just like we see with the iPad and with the Galaxy Note lineup. So at least there are some benefits there, let's see what we get. And finally, for the interesting news of the day, we have the first leak schematic of the iWatch. It's interesting. We haven't seen any leaked photos of this product for the first time ever. Apple is terrible when it comes to leaks, but uh, we've got the schematics, we've got a leaked housing, and apparently the design will not be round or square. It'll have round edges, sort of like what we see on the icons of the iPhone and what we've seen with the icons of the Mac forever. Apparently, Apple is going to retain that design, which uh, if you read the Steve Jobs biography, there is a purpose for this. But in addition to that, it seems that this product will be waterproof. 20 meters in depth. It will also have a microphone and a speaker for Siri among a terrible performing one day battery life. We'll see how that goes. But that leads me to the question of the day. Uh, what would be the perfect design for a smartwatch for you? Is it round? Is it square? Is it uh, round edges like we see with these iWatch schematics? Because in my case, honestly, you know, you can have as many as two or three watches. So if the price is right, I would rather have different options. And reports claim that the iWatch will have two designs and four different color variants per design. So uh, leave us a comment down below. What would be your preferred? Friends, you know the drill. If you want to get the news earlier before this video is filmed, make sure you follow us on pocketnow.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can also follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. We will see you tomorrow.